So we're at Butcher and B in Charleston's Upper King neighborhood. A cool spot known for its insanely good sandwiches. I come to Butcher and B about once a week, usually with my brothers, because I love the family atmosphere. They pull from a lot of different influences kind of all over the world and combine that with a really cool local farm to table kind of vibe. Chef William Moe got his start in Charleston and then spent a stint in New York City before returning to his roots. He hopes to elevate Charleston's food scene by changing his menu every single day. This is not your average sandwich shop. It has gotten props from GQ, Bon Appetit, and even New York Times. It's always packed on the inside. Let's go check out what the fuss is about. All right, well, this is a really dope spot. Tell us about Butcher and Beef. We've been here for just over three years now. It's a cool, rustic spot, and we kind of bring that into the sandwiches that we make. The bacon and broccoli cheddar sandwich is layered with aged cheddar, roasted broccoli, and topped with crisp bacon. The sweet potato sandwich comes packed with Gruyere cheese, caramelized onions, and local sweet potatoes. Both sandwiches are grilled to perfection on Butcher and B's fresh baked bread. Oh my gosh, now looking at this, look at the layers on this sandwich. Oh, the bacon has wings. All right, I'm getting ready. Man, you ready? Mmm. Oh, I'm loving this. The cheese, you get the little oil from the cheese that's leaking into the sweet potato. The bread is so fresh. I taste the smokiness of the bacon, the melty goodness of just the cheese. The Gruyere cheese is a little bit sweeter than your average cheddar, but it's still got that bite, but it's balanced out with the sweet potato and the sweet grilled cheese. That cheddar is sharper than the Rocky Mountains. Man, you're talking about that cheddar and broccoli like I need to try it. You talking about that sweet potatoes like I need to try it. Fun bro, switch up. Actually, that broccoli adds that little crunch to it, adds that firmness. You know bread's good when you can squeeze it like that. That's how you know it's fresh. You didn't buy this from your local grocery store. This is baked in-house. Oh, no. In-house. Oh, no. In-house, son. This sandwich is so Charleston. You've got the local sweet potato, the Gruyere cheese, the caramelized onions, the house-made bread. I can totally taste the history in it, but at the same time, I can taste the modern twist together. This sandwich is smack. Smack. S-H-M-A-C-K-I-N apostrophe. 